Thank you, Mr. Co-President. That's the second time today that you have ignored me when I was expressing good manners, standing up and doing the appropriate call for a motion. I wish to, I wish to call attention to Chapter 6 of the Rules of Procedures, Interruptive and Procedural Motions, Rule 191, Suspension or Closure of the Sitting. This morning I raised this point before you. You stood up and walked away. You left me without answering my question. If 40 members of this chamber decide to stand up at this moment, we are entitled to have a vote on whether we suspend the motions and sitting today on the disgraceful treatment we have had over TTIP. This will send out a strong message to our constituents that we are supporting them. So I am asking that 40 members of this chamber stand up and we are entitled to a vote to suspend this motion under Rule 191. Will 40 members please stand up if they support that opportunity? Allora, questa mattina la sua richiesta è... Thank you very much. This morning you requested to take the floor once the session had already been suspended. On the basis of Rule 191, you are suggesting that 40 members can request the suspension of the session and I therefore have to put this to the vote. I shall therefore proceed to do so. We shall have a roll call vote on the question of whether the session should be suspended. If you vote yes, you ask for the suspension of the session. If you vote no, you're against it. The vote is open. La votazione è chiusa. The vote is closed. La proposta è stata respinta. The, vote has, the motion has been rejected. We shall therefore continue with the voting session. Richiama regolamento, onorevole la parola. You have the floor, sir, for point of order. In base al regolamento, l'articolo 100... On the basis of Rule 152 and Rule 190, I would like to raise a question of interpretation. If you decide to postpone a vote and a discussion to the next to a subsequent session you need to say when and where the debate will take place this was not done in this instance therefore i request that this is rectified and i would request that this matter is put to president schulz we need to know when the debate will take place translation i can say also in english if you want <laughs> On the basis of the rules, that it is necessary on the basis of the rules to indicate the date and time at which the debate and vote will subsequently take place. This was not done. Therefore, I now request you to tell us when will we debate TTIP and when will we vote on TTIP. As I understand it, it is to be referred back to INTA, to the committee, at its next meeting. And I would request that you therefore put TTIP, the debate and vote on the agenda for July. Thank you. Martina, non si è President, this morning the debate was not on this matter. It was simply on the debate was on the basis of whether the debate should be deferred because the President had already decided that the voting should be deferred.